What about art? Have you uh, explored, you know, these image creation tools and these video creation tools? I imagine they're quite expensive um, and they also are fairly hard to control. Like sometimes you get amazing output. Sometimes you're like, oh, what's that? Yep. You know, it, yep. eight fingers, <laughs> you know, yep. with, we've all seen plenty of those. Like everything's perfect. It's that the person has three fingers. You're like, mm. yep. <laughs> But, yeah, I'll uh, give you a. What are you doing there? I'll give you a little peek into our roadmap. So we're going to release what we call Gen AI 2.0 before the end mm. of the year, which is going to make mm. our creatives a lot better, more uh, templates, more transitions, uh, mm. text on screen uh, that's more dynamic. Really make yeah. the videos yeah. pop and still with yeah. the same speed. T- it takes you know two to three seconds to generate it. Uh, so that's yeah, going to be crazy. really great. In the meantime, we're always experimenting. And I talked to the founder of Pika Labs, you know, all mm-hmm. these companies, they've raised like 100 million. Uh, Runway yeah. ML, Oh yeah. Uh, yeah. talked to them. Because OpenAI is a partner, uh, we've talked yeah. to them about getting early Sora beta access. I think everyone wants that Sora. Uh, yeah, they were course. used. There was like a Toys R Us commercial that was yeah. generated. So the reality of all those tools, uh, as you said, uh, I've talked to a lot of, there's these, really great gen AI video editors that are messing around with this stuff, you know, mm-hmm. Emmy, Emmy award winning editors. I've gone to a few conferences and they all say the same thing. There's no one today. That's just like prompting that Toys R Us commercial. Let's stick on that yeah. for a second. It's not yeah, just yeah. like build yeah. me the Toys R Us commercial. What happened yeah. is yeah. they are yeah. doing prompting thousands of prompts, yes. pulling, the assets they're getting out of it into post-production tools that everyone knows yeah. and love. I was, I was a yeah. Premiere pro guy back in the day, you know, final yeah. cut avid, what have you yeah. into yeah. after effects. They're putting tons of work into it, tons of labor, human labor. Mm-hmm. And then they are also um, basically the GPU cost to <laughs> train those models and run it. Yeah. These are getting to the same levels that we were talking about yeah. before, whereas 10,000 plus, to produce. Yeah. So yeah. it's not there yet. The Gen AI yeah. Yeah. video from Runway, et cetera, is not there yet. Yeah. That being said, we're always testing. We're always looking to integrate our kind of master plan and talking to these folks is mm-hmm. we will continue to integrate the best of Gen AI large language models. And as yeah. they get better, we'll integrate with their APIs and our creative will get better. But our yeah. goal is always to make it really fast and frictionless. And yeah. then showcase the best of Gen AI on streaming TV. So they're not doing the ad tech piece, but we're clearly in the ad tech sure. domain. So that's sure. kind of the long term vision is once one of these is faster, cheaper, and yeah. more reliable, we'll be there to integrate and showcase it. 